Here we go, Frankie Barker, our semi-main event. Full credit to Cy and Edgy, Rebellion Muay Thai. And a big thank you to the firebrandclothing.com for getting behind this semi-main event. We've got Roy Wills from the Thai Boxing Pit in WA coming off a win last week in Perth against Tim Morrison, taking on from South Australia the General Brian Hass. Brian's had 16 Hey guys, we're doing full-time rules, five rounds, OK? Try and listen for Mike and me at all times on my hands. And the ISK hands up at all times, right? Touch gloves. Good luck to both of you. years of age, Roy Wills, 19 years of age. 19 fights, two times. WKN State Champion over in WA. Mate, as tough as they come, these two boys. And the boys from the pit, one nice. thing they never do, they never quit. Absolutely not. And it's interesting how young these boys are and, how, and what their records are. The amount of experience they have between them is, is incredible. Looking forward to a very tactical, technical, terrific fight. Yeah, and again, both the you know, Again, we've got South Australia versus Western Australia here in Melbourne. So full credit to the promoter for bringing out the best fighters. Five two-minute rounds, full tie rules. Very aggressive looking Brian Hayes to start this one. This one off. Last time I saw Brian fighting was on the Joe Nader promotion here in Melbourne a couple of years ago. Oh, nice left hook. He's hurt. He's hurt bad in that corner. He's rocked Roy, Will Roy Wills. He really one has. Thing, one thing about Roy Wills, he'll fight his way out of this. He fought last week on Epic Five over in Perth. Oh, man. He's, Brian Haas is just absolutely unloading right now on, on Roy Wills. He's got to get out of that corner or clinch. And you can hear Blair Smith just saying to him, get out of that corner, and that's exactly what he's done. Tell you what, this is what fighting's all about, mate. These boys, they've come to put on a show. What an incredible start to this fight. Yeah, Roy Wills now just starting to take control in the grapple. He'll settle down. He's a tough kid, mate. 19 years of age. He's a concreter. He's as, he's as hard as. Step up elbow. Switch up elbow there. Crossing elbow there from, from Roy Wills as well. So oh, Brian has made he's already he must be thinking what do I have to do to put this kid down? Absolutely. I mean he's given him his best shot so far and he's still there. Roy Wills is still there. Mate, the motto of the boys in the pit is that the pit never quit. And I tell you what, I've called these boys fighting over in Perth, mate, and they are hardcore. Absolutely, it's obvious. These boys are in such great shape. Technically tough. And Just, very composed under a lot of pressure. Yeah, beautiful knees there from Roy Wills. Beautiful body kick, nice straight elbow off that right hand side. Beautiful. Right, Brian Hass now trained by Alan Walkington out of Adelaide. So right, Brian's not looking phased though. He's come out and he threw absolutely everything at it the first minute of this bout. Oh, yeah, that's Roy Wills withstood the onslaught that was the general Brian Hass, and he came back with some of his own. Again, big thank you to Firebrand Clothing. They've produced the Rebellion Muay Thai t-shirts here tonight. They've done a sensational job. Are we going to see Haas come out again? Aggressive. Yeah, Brian Haas is just uh, coming forward again. Roy's got to get out of that corner again, just lock on the grapple. He's good sharp elbows again. Like we didn't see that one coming. Mills. Nice crossing elbow by Wills. Spinning elbow by Wills. Body kick. I'll tell you what, you get your money's worth when you get these boys in centre ring. Man, Brian Haas has got some heavy hands, and let me tell you, 
Roy Wills has got a, a rock solid chin. Mate, he's a concreter. He probably eats, eats <laughs> concrete for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Well, this is interesting. We're going to see what Brian Haas has against the ropes. See what kind of defense he has and what kind of answers he has right now for Roy Wills, who has him against the ropes in the neutral corner. I'll tell you what, he comes from a good pedigree though. Roy Wills training out of the Thai box. And he's got Blair Smith over there, Blair's son, Toby Smith over in Thailand, living over there, living the dream. That kid's going to be a future world champion. They've got James McAmacorry, Sam Ballantyne. They're a tough bunch over there. But I'll tell you what, Brian Hass, he's bored on here tonight as well. Oh, nice. Nice short elbow from that lead hand by Brian. Brian Haas. Just the contrast in the build too. Oh. Big height and reach advantage to Roy Wills. Oh, nice left hand. That was a beautiful question mark kick. I haven't seen them for a long time, Bushy. So last time I saw Brian Haas fighting here in Melbourne, I think he was around 56 kilos. He's bulked up a bit. This one oh, weighed in at 60 kilos. By, oh, Brian Haas landing some big shots. Roy Wills eating those shots. Blush and he's still there. Man, what do you have to do to put this kid away, huh? So six, Incredible. 19 fights for 16 wins. Six KOs. One tough kid, mate, from Perth from the Thai Bye. boxing pit. But Brian, the general, has. Mate, he has brought it all to centre ring here tonight. Two rounds down. This is a five round fight. Frank Barker, our semi main event. Brian, the general, has from Adelaide taking on Roy Wills from the pit. And the boys from the quit, they never quit. Semi main event, five two minute rounds. This has had everything in the first two rounds, mate. Are they going to last the five rounds? Well, Brian Hart's come out in the first two rounds and just started swinging. Obviously, you know, Roy Wills, you know, weathered the storm in the first round, looking a little worse for wear at the end of the second with Brian Hart really turning it on. Let's see what the boys have got in the third round. But it's been absolutely action-packed, worthy of a main event. This one's a semi-main event. We've got one fight to go after this one. So round three, Brian Hass is pushing referee Darren Bauer out of the way, just wanting to get to Roy Wills. And they, they talk about the feeling out process. Mate, what feeling out process? These boys, just from, from the very first battle of the first round, just been on it. Good crossing elbow there from Brian Hass. Absolutely. Brian Hass really poor on the pressure. He got some, some good results with some you know big, big hands early on. He's going with the same. Here Blair just calling out to Roy to, to use the knees. Oh, oh downward, elbow. downward elbow right on the top of the sky on Brian Hass. Bit of a turning of the tables in this third round, whereas Brian Hass has just controlled the first couple of rounds, just walking forward into Roy Wills. Roy's taken the ascendancy in this round. That kick. Brian just looks to be slowing down a little bit, Frank. Yeah, well, the, the problem with coming out and swinging, you know, in the first three rounds, or, you know, it, it really starts to deplete your energy. It takes a lot of sting out of you. Um, I, I'm hoping that Brian Haas can continue this pace, but like you said, he was starting to notice, you know, slowing down. Hopefully, this won't slow down much more because Roy Wills starting to get his measure. Same thing though, Roy must be thinking, what do I have to do to put this kid down? He just keeps walking towards me. He's got a steely look in his eye, Brian has. Oh, beautiful knee. Nice right hand left hook. I had the pleasure of calling Roy Wills versus Mitch Seth. Mitch Seth is our main event here tonight. These boys fought in the main event over at Nemesis number two in Perth on the 10th of February. In the round three, Red Scooter. Tell you what, mate, doesn't get much better than this here in centre ring. No. Round four, Red Scooter. Round four. So round four, big thank you to Manos from Firebrand Clothing again. Apparently put together the Rebellion Muay Thai t-shirts here tonight. Firebrand Clothing, have a look for them on the internet. Bring in the best clothing. Nice elbow there by Roy Wills. Oh, good kick. 
kick there from Roy Wills. Wow. Ryan has missed the mark. Did a complete 360. Roy Wills followed up with a beautiful kick. Spinning back elbow. Oh, nice left hook. So we're judges for this one, Kane W, Matt Reed, Mark Corrie. It's going to be interesting to see how they score this one, Frank. Yeah, exactly. You know, in Muay Thai, usually, you know, punches don't score as highly as elbows do, especially knees and leg kicks or, or head kicks in that, for that matter. So, like, yeah, good point. Interesting to see how they're going to call this fight so far. Well, certainly the first two and a half rounds, the aggressor was uh, Brian Haas, but Roy Wills has turned the tables a bit. Absolutely. You know, Brian Haas really came out early, and this is the fourth round now. It came out early again, but... Like I said earlier, you know, Roy Wills, and we both agree, he's starting to turn the fight around. Come on, fight fans, feel free to make some noise in here! So, Brian Hass, he just continually walks forward, mate. Oh, beautiful left hook. Man, Roy Wills has got a chin, let me tell you. You're not kidding when they say they breed him tough down in the pit. <laughs> Mate, the pit never quit, don't you worry about that. They will, they will fight till the end, these boys. As I said, mate, he come off a five, he's, he's just come off a five-round win over there in Perth last weekend. I tell you what, any promoter, any promoter the out there around Australia, you want to put on a, 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 a good show, you get these two boys on your card, match them up against anyone. You get your money's worth. Beautiful head kick. Roy Wills really starting to turn it on now. Big fourth round, but I love the attitude of the general Brian has. He's just he's just got aggression built up in him. Here we go, Frankie. Fifth and final round, proudly brought to you by Firebrand Clothing. Roy Wills from the Thai Boxing Pit. The general Brian has trained by Alan Walkington from South Australia. Blair Smith was really having some words to, to Roy. Just something he's really got to bring him home in his fifth round. To take nothing away from the power tour of the general Brian Hess. Absolutely not, you know. But um, Roy Wills just seems seems to look like the the fresher of the two, the more crisp of the two. Well, Brian's two national titles, mate. He's won them both by KO, so he's certainly got some power at that level. But he hasn't been able to put Roy Wills away at the moment. Well, any lesser man would have dropped to at least one knee by this stage. We're heading into the final minute of this fight, Rex. We're going to make some noise in here! Oh, a big Superman punch there from the general. Roy Wills just not phased. Big crossing oh, elbow, just missing the mark. That just missed, Bushy. That just missed. A sense of urgency for both fighters right now. Looking at landing some really good shots. Just like the way both boys are countering as well. Yeah, absolutely. So Brian's really bulked up, as we called his fight a couple of years ago here in Melbourne. He was fighting around 55, 57 kilos. He's really bulked up. Final 30 seconds! Spinning back elbow there from Roy Wills. 30 seconds ago, the both boys then to bring it home. Attempted Superman punch there from, from Brian Hass. So, mate, the resolve of both of these fighters is second to none. As I said, any promoter that wants to get a dream matchup, get both of these boys on your card, match them up against anyone of the 60 kilo weight range, and you'll get your money's worth. Brian has unloading in the red corner. Mate, these boys could keep going a few more rounds. Wow, what a war. Hard to call that fight. Mate, hard, hard to call. Very difficult to call, Bushy. I am going to stay off the fence on this one. Full credit to both boys, mate. Absolutely sensational. I'll let you jump in centre ring and have a chat to, to, to the winner. But, mate, this one will go to the judges. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, at the end of five rounds of Muay Thai, once again, we go to the judges' scorecard. We have a unanimous points decision. Your winner, the Blue Corner, Roy Wills. There you go, unanimous points decision to Roy Wills from the Thai boxing pin over Brian Hass. Absolutely sensational semi-main event. As I said, any promoter wants to get... Uh, Get some boys on for a bit of action, call these two boys. But a big win there to Roy Wills, backing up his win on Epic 5 in Perth last week. All right, I'm here with your winner, Roy Wills. Roy, congratulations. How are you feeling right now? Um... 
Yeah, I'm feeling pretty dazed actually. These punches, man. I was rocked in, I think, the first 10 seconds or whatever, but yeah. Well, I was just going to ask you, you know, did you anticipate that uh, Brian Haas was going to come out so aggressive in the first four rounds? Uh, yeah, I pretty much anticipated that. Um, I knew that he's knocked out Concha, and that's a pretty good feat, so uh, we were training pretty much, keep a tight guard, use the teep a lot, and uh, the left kick every time we could try to come in. Well, you, you really weathered the storm in those first three rounds. You really started coming out with some great tactics of your own, with some great cutting elbows as well. Was that part of your plan coming to this fight? Uh, yeah, it was. Um, I, I'm really fit. I just came off a fight last weekend as well. Luckily, I was not injured, so I could take this fight. So I was definitely fit, and I thought maybe I'd be able to outlast him and catch him in the last few rounds. Absolutely. I, we know, Bushy and I were comment, calling the fight, and we noticed that he started slowing down a little bit uh, in the middle of the fourth round. Did you notice he was slowing down? Yeah, yeah. Um, my trainer was telling me every, in between rounds that he's, he's just punched himself out yet. Yeah, and um, so I just tried to pile on the points. I, uh, if I hurt him, I was going to pounce, but I couldn't really see. He has a good poke face if I did hurt him, but... Well, I've got to say, there's an incredible performance from both of you, and um, you, 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 you definitely pulled the win out with some great technique. Congratulations to you. I'm looking forward to seeing you fight again. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together, please, for Roy Will.